The Thunder and Danilo Gallinari have a big, big choice to make this offseason, whenever that offseason is going to be. Does he stay with the Thunder? Does he just walk away as a free agent, or is he signed and traded? I think what's going to ultimately happen, as much as I would love to keep Gallo on this team, uh, I think he'll be signed and traded, and it'll probably be ultimately the best thing for both sides because, you know, he is older, and, you know, the Thunder's new timeline is going to be to surround Shea with young prospects and draft picks and all those things. And you can get something for him. There's going to be teams that want Gallo, and they'll give up maybe a first-round draft pick or a young guy. I think it works out for both sides to do that. Yeah, if we've got to trade them, then sign and trade is definitely the way we want to go. It would really suck for him to leave and to not get anything in return. And also, yeah, I don't think people realize how old he is. Like, I don't think that I really fully realized this until the other day when I saw something that was like drafted in like 2008. And I was like, what? I thought he would like been in like, like five years. But yeah, he's pretty old. Um, but I want the Thunder to keep him if possible. So I think he fits really well with this team. The chemistry is really good. And in the past, the Thunder have had a really hard time filling that power forward position. And now they finally found someone who fits the role that we need. He's a shooter. He can play defense. He doesn't need the ball in his hand. And that's hard to come by in the NBA. So I think if you've got a good thing, hold on to it if you can. For sure. He's such a, he's almost an all-star level. Like he's near all-star level. He's that good. He's basically a 50, 40, 90 guy. He shoots so well. He's so efficient, a uh, high volume scorer. I just don't know if, if Presti keeps his team around. It all depends on Chris Paul. When Royce Young was on the Crossbolts name drop, uh, <laughs> he mentioned, you know, it all starts and ends with Chris Paul. If he's traded, you know, they probably move on. If they keep them, they probably keep these guys. But I think Gallo will be traded. 